hello again we have reached the fun part of the of the workshop and now we are going to run auto ml automatic machine learning automated machine learning uh, which is available with oml for pi for python um, in this case uh, we are going to ask the machine or the database itself to give us a list of algorithms which are the best algorithms to be used for a certain use case in particular. And we're gonna do it for two tasks. We're gonna do it both for classification and for the regression tasks. Um, first one and then the other, the other one. Uh, this is the, I, the ideal way to do it when you have no experience with OML like myself and you just want the database system to give you the best algorithms to be used in your machine learning models and then you can pick one of those algorithms uh, and create your models based on those algorithms so i'm going to import the auto ml uh, from the from the library here from the oml library oracle machine learning and i'm going to create again the proxy object my data frame oml data frame from the table i have in the oracle database uh, and then i'm going to create two data frames two data sets one for classification with c at the end and the other one for regression with an r at the end in the classification the data frame i'm going to drop the ltv numerical column because this is the one which it is not useful for classification. This is the one we use for regression. And in the regression data model, I'm gonna drop the LTV pin column, which is the labels, high, medium, low, and very high, that are used for classification, and they are not useful in regression. So I'm gonna run this uh, block here. And now, I'm going to start with the classification first. And for classification, I'm going to split the data into 80 20 uh, splits for training and testing. And then I'm going to create the algorithm selection uh, with auto ML uh, for classification. Uh, I'm specifying mining, mining function classification here. And I'm specifying score metrics and the number of parallel executions I can have for this creation, for this model uh, creation. If you want to see all the settings and all the possible uh, options you have to create this uh, uh, automated algorithm selection, you can check the documentation here with this link. And then I'm going to run the algorithm and get the first three uh, algorithms in the list uh, based on their ranking. So let me see if I'm going to have uh, um, uh, the algorithms I have used until now in the list. Uh, let's see if I was uh, lucky enough to use the proper algorithms in my previous models. It takes a while, of course, because it, it is testing on a sample of the data, multiple algorithms, and it creates uh, some, uh, some, uh, some um, executions and some trainings to identify the best one and then i'm going to specify the i'm going to list the first three algorithms in my ranking so you can see here i have the neural network which is the best one with the score of 96 percent random forest is the second one with a score of 89 percent and decision tree is the third one with a score of 85 percent if i remember well i have used neural network and decision tree until now in my previous machine learning models so i was lucky enough to use the, one of the best maybe the two of the best algorithms in my in my ranking here for classification now i'm going to do the same for regression so i'm going to split the data the regression uh, data frame in this case into 80 20 percent uh, splits for uh, training and uh, testing purposes and uh, <clears throat> training on, uh, and the training is like before here is going to be used 
uh, in two different matrices, one for the attributes and the other one for just the, with just the labels, the X and Y matrices, we already know. And the testing is also split into two matrices, uh, X test and Y test, uh, the one with the labels having the data but not the value I'm looking to, to identify, to predict. And the, one, the other one with just the values, the numerical values. And let's do the split here. And then I'm going to run again the automated algorithm selection from AutoML, Oracle AutoML, to identify the most useful algorithms for regression. In this case, I'm specifying the mining function regression. It is very simple to use. If you have no idea about Oracle machine learning, this is the best way to do it. Use AutoML. And then here I can uh, run the selection to identify the most, the, the, the three, the first three most important uh, algorithms for my predictions. And um, I'm using the, the training uh, data in this case to um, identify those algorithms, just the training data. I'm not going to test this time the, the, the in, in this lab, I'm not going to do the testing. You can test your algorithm by yourself using the testing data if you want. Uh, the same for the classification. And now I'm going to list the first three uh, algorithms. Um, I think no. This in this case, I'm specifying. Uh, yeah, this is the first three. Let's see, algorithms for the regression uh, task. So again, I have uh, neural networks, then generalized linear model, and then uh, generalized generalized linear model uh, reach. So I think I also used the generalized. Yes, I used the generalized linear model for regression in the in the previous uh, regression exercise I have I, uh, with the model I have created there. So I actually use the second one, the second best one. The, the best one as AutoML is specifying here with the 99% uh, score is the neural network. So I maybe I should use this one the next time. Thank you very much.